to in your catalogs. If you flip to page five, you're gonna find me <laughs> with my matching shoes, shirt, and hat. Welcome to the Corvette vlog, you guys. My name is Rick Conti, and we are having so much fun bringing you so much Corvette content in many different avenues and aspects of the lifestyle that we all enjoy, share, and are simply curious about. Hey, coming up tomorrow, I have a great conversation with you guys. Your request, thanks for asking, thanks for caring. Um, I think you'll enjoy that vlog where I just sit and talk with you. I'm at a lake setting, as we showed you yesterday. Uh, what I ordered and what I didn't order and why on my 2021 Corvette. And then on Monday, we're gonna have a conversation, share one with you from the Corvette plant manager. And you're gonna find some similarities in his conversation, stuff that we've talked about on this channel, about build processes, order processes, uh, that's coming up on Monday. Well, today, well, it's, yeah, it's a beautiful morning. It's Saturday in the car business, otherwise known as game day. You guys are curious on who's buying these cars. So today on the vlog, our deliveries from last Saturday. Oh yeah, this is cool. Look at this, guys. Friends gathering, connecting through this car. What are you running for? You're not a stranger to this camera. What are you running for? Everybody knows Mark Thomas. And there's Phil, the man of the hour. Are you, Rick? Dude, been good to see you, man. It has been, been a long wait, wait though. I'll tell you what, though. Congratulations. Thank what you. do you think? What do you think, I, man? I think it's fantastic. Yeah, it is. You still got some accessories that aren't here yet, and yeah. I appeal to the people at Chevrolet to. Uh, to freaking get it together, man. This is this is nuts. Getting accessories two, three, four weeks after the car's here. But okay, moving on. <laughs> I just had to get hey, that out. The other thing, the other thing, Rick, you're going to be looking for me is my high wing. Yes, I know. We're looking for the high. You know wing. what? I wasn't even going to bring that up today. I didn't want to rub it in. You are yet another victim of the high wing delete from Chevrolet, right. which is bizarre. Because here's another thing that's bizarre. And actually, Mark brought this up to me this morning. I'm going to just kind of not really throw you under the bus, but bring it to, to everybody's attention. There's people that have convertibles that are built now well after that Chevrolet's canceled the high wing, and they're getting the high wing. How in the hell is that even possible? I told you, this accessory thing, freaking kooky, man. So I'm sorry about that, Phil. Maybe we might find one for you. No. Might just find one for you. Hey, you did not respond to my uh, message on the video where you were showing the colors of the new ceramic. Uh, did you reply on the uh, I, on the YouTube channel? Yeah. What's your handle? Is it just your name or? Yeah. Okay, I, I look for it. I, maybe I looked at the wrong video. Listen, I'm disappointed <laughs> because I, I asked you then after they introduced the new red. Uh, oh, the red, red mist. Yeah. Metallic. Yep. I said, Rick, I, I got a favor to ask of you. I want you to send my car to the body shop, have them do a repaint <laughs> in that. But I'm still planning. To, I'm still planning to pick it up on Saturday. Oh, okay. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't see that comment. Yeah, go get a repaint. I can't even get your splash guards. Are you kidding me? <laughs> How the heck am I going to do that? But I want to thank you for not only the business, but through the whole process. It's nice that you live relatively close, about an hour away. We yeah. We've had some great conversations. You have been a gentleman and just wonderful to talk and deal with. So thank you for that. Well, Seriously. Only because you've been a gentleman. Yeah, right? Thanks, man. You're awesome, man. Really, I'm happy for you. Yeah. And now you. Get to take get this to, to the car the show tomorrow. That's right, dude. <laughs> How's that ceramic coat feel? Look at the door just slipped out of your hand. It feels great, doesn't it? It's beautiful. And we'll show you on the screen as we've been doing lately in the vlogs. A lot of people want to know what did he order? Tell us his specs. And just briefly, uh, you did a 2LT with the GT2 seats, right. and you did do a front lift, if I remember correctly. Right. And you're going to get side rocker extensions that aren't here. Right. And did you splash do cards. splash cards? Did you do engine cover too? I did the engine cover. Okay. It's not on yet. No, it's not on yet. No, yeah, they all send those together, or they don't send anything. Okay. Correct. I did uh, high performance exhaust. Yes. And high wing that, of course, you didn't get. High wing, right? Um, and you're a pretty tall guy. Let me stand yeah, back here. How tall are you? I'm uh, six two. You're six two. Yeah, you do. You so, look like you're. T well, maybe well, I'm just short. You look like you're six four to me. Yeah. Well, the seat's probably up. I, let me see if I remember how Rick said to get in. Ah, there we go. Leg in first, butt down, head down, in. Leg come over. Ta-da! Nice job. We'll get this all programmed up nice for you too, though. But how you feel? You look good in there. Oh, it fits great. No, you're 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 comfortable, man. I still have head room. You got a lot of leg room. You got long legs too, man. Yeah, I don't know. Is this back or not? Uh, again, I haven't even set it all the way up. Yeah, no, it, it should go back. 
There she dropped down even more. Oh, look at Picked you up even another couple of inches. These things are so fun to drive. Of course, any Corvette is fun to drive, truly. But I mean, this is this is uh, the latest. Mark was telling me about his experience down at uh, at the track at the track at the at the museum. Yeah. Yeah. yeah well, don't I'd forget, like you now get a discount to Spring Mountain, right? Which is the ultimate uh, in the world, in my opinion, uh, out in Nevada. You got a year to use that discount coupon. You drive their cars, and I encourage it because of the thrill, but just also the education that you're going to get in this mid-engine car. Yeah, I'm yeah, happy for you. Comfortable seats. Yeah, they are. See, I'm. Uh, thank you for listening on my suggestion for the GT2. Yeah. I tell a lot of guys GT2, no. especially your taller guys, because this side bolster is extended a little bit. I think it's going to hold you nice, real nice area back behind the shoulders and the headrest. I think that fits well. You, uh, obviously, I'm thin, but I don't think I would have liked the GT3 seats, the, oh, competition, the, the competition with seats? the high bolster yeah. on there. I, yeah. I just wouldn't have felt comfortable setting it. For racing. Thing. And if you had that seat for the track session only, touche. But for what most folks drive, no, man, I just, I'm not into that. Hey, nice red caliper upgrade goes great with the torch red. I mean, that is, that's almost a given, guys. That's just beautiful. It really is. So where's the car show at? Uh, it's in Duncan Falls, just uh, south of Zanesville on Route 60. Okay, make yeah, sure you text so. us some pictures so we can share that in the vlog. Yeah, People I'll, see how yeah, you do. And I'll we're do hoping that. that we see a trophy picture. <laughs> you know, it, you may. They're they're, uh, they're doing it as a cruise in because of the COVID restrictions. Sure. So I understand they're going to have a lottery drawing for the trophies based huh. on the card numbers that you're assigned when you go in. So they're not really they're, they're not judging. really judging anything. I go do judging. Oh, so it'll be random draw. Okay, random draw. Side. Okay, wow. It's a little different. So you can roll in with yeah. something that's eight colors and <laughs> doors falling off and win. <laughs> right, yeah, exactly. right. Oh, boy. Exactly. All right, this is going to be a fun day. we got to get going here, but right. thanks for sharing the moment with us, guys, and uh, we'll give Phil a little send-off. Patty knows how this deal works. I do. All yeah, right. That'll be fun. Thank you, sir. Uh, really seriously thanks for hanging in there is is all i can say at this point to be at this point is a blast but have fun at the show tomorrow yeah i will and uh i want to tell you rick it's real it's been a pleasant experience with thanks, you will enjoy it no you too i man. hated the long wait but it's yeah, worthwhile. Dude, it's I, worth I know it. i do i get it and it sometimes it was frustrating for me too because you know i was i was locked up as far as trying to give you guys some information and i wouldn't i wouldn't mislead you it's just we had nothing nothing from chevy it was like man this was tough no, but right. worth I'm the wait, glad. though, is what I'm everybody says, right? Yeah. yeah. I'm sure they're glad it's over now, too. Yeah. All right. Phil Stain here in Ohio. He'll be back for the accessories. A little send off. Pack. All right, buddy. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So once again, we uh, continue. Waited a year to get to this point right now. Folks standing behind the camera were here about it. You guys here about a year ago, right? Yep. At the reveal that we had at the dealership where you got a chance to see a C8 and sit in it. You guys exactly. got to sit in it. We got I to didn't. Sit in it. Yep. it was crazy. At the end of the day, I let all the customers sit in. You guys all waited in line down the hallway. So everyone got done. I'm like, oh, good. Everyone's you done. He's done. Front. I go to sit. I, yeah, I know. I got that done. I got in trouble for that. And I actually sat in the car. And then the guy says, excuse me, Rick, I need you to get out of the car. I said, well, wait a minute. Everybody's gone. I want to sit in the damn thing. No, we got to get going. We got another place. We got to tear it down. So you guys were <laughs> sat in it, and I literally sat in it. He took me out of there, put the cover over it. I didn't get to sit in the car. Never sat in another car, I think, until, oh, gosh, well, I think until we actually started getting ours. Or, no, it was uh, when I went to uh, Nevada oh. in December. So it, wow. it was just like forever. So I appreciate you waiting and hanging in. There's David and his wife, Sherry, the proud owners. And this is Lanny. <laughs> And he was on the vlog last September. You guys started watching the channel after that. Can you believe how freaking tall this guy is? Six, seven, and you fit in the car, don't you? Yeah. You do. Yeah. 
I'll get in if you want me to. No, no I, that's not my call. No. You, you have to talk oh, to the okay. owner of the car over oh, there. That's right. Although I'm holding the keys. Oh, you need to. <laughs> I'm holding the keys. I don't dare. No, he hasn't. That, sa he hasn't sat at it yet. You have sat in your own car. I yet? can't be. I can't okay, be the, the answer is no. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, it's great uh, to see you guys. Thanks for watching the channel. Thanks for being a part of it. And we showed off your car just a little bit. Even when it was dirty, I showed it off on Instagram and you sent me a message. You go, man, that thing looks really good. It does look good. Just a little extra special. It looks a little better because you knew it was yours. That's it. <laughs> That's exactly right. And it is nice. And you guys like on the channel when we show you the cars that people are buying and show you their specs. So I'll give you a slide up here in just a bit so you can see the full specs that David ordered. And you guys, I, I was very honest. I was not a fan of the color on the body blade. But on Long Beach, guys, this works. How many vets have you had, man? Fourth. This is the fourth one. Fourth one? What else have you had? We had a uh, 68 big block. Oh. We had a 2012 convertible, 2016 C51. Yeah. And now we have this. Yeah, fantastic. All right. Any exciting plans, trips, or anything planned in the new vet, or just happy to get the darn thing? Just happy to have it. Yeah. You know? <laughs> Touche. Good answer. Wherever we go, we go. All right, fantastic. All right, we're going to show them how to use it. I wanted you guys to meet who's getting the car and the people that enjoy them getting the car, their friends there. And then we're going to do a send off pat. So hang on. He's got the Z mode on right now. You guys can hear that. That beautiful pitter patter that you're not going to hear if we go to EV. Hey. <laughs> Little send off pad for David and Sherry right here in Ohio. What? All right. I'll rub the Z51 wing. All right. Have fun, man. happening again every customer that's here for delivery people just are gravitating to this car it's exactly what I told you guys what do you want to do with your car show it off let's join the crowd hi Rick tire pass customers right there yeah <laughs> How you doing, sir? Good. Welcome on YouTube. Oh, you do? Welcome You're on YouTube. Hey, thank you, man. Appreciate that. You did? Oh, God bless you. Fantastic. You know what's funny? You came in here, and I almost, I almost called you yesterday, and said, "Make sure she wears her Corvette pants. I got to get me some of them. Those are cool. Because when you came in to finalize the order, you came in to finalize the order, and she was wearing those pants. I took a picture, and I've never used them on the vlog, but we'll use them today, most appropriate, because you're picking up your new car. I'm so happy for you, man. You see, I've got my shadow gray polo shirt on. Yeah, absolutely. Congratulations, man. Thank you. So I let you look at it and kind of drool over it for a few minutes before we came out here. But I mean, what do you what do you think of this thing, man? Oh my God. I mean, I'm telling these folks that the, we came for your September. Yeah, last year. Yeah, mm -hmm. and uh, this is how close I got to that. <laughs> you never, oh my gosh. So we were looking in the back and the front, and this is like the first time I've had a opportunity. Wow. To so you've never even sat in a C8? We sat, Kathy and I both had an opportunity to sit in the passenger seat and it was oh. that long because there was somebody else. Oh, because the lines were going pushes. all the way around the car. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's crazy. That's... That is crazy. Well, now it's yours. Yeah. Now it's yours, man. Yeah, and so, the, and so I started reading all the articles between then and now. Right. And every time I did, I'd go, I, I made a good decision. That's awesome. Right? Yeah, that's great. <laughs> this is a good that's great. Yeah. And much more room than I thought. Oh, in the front area? Yeah. Yeah, you're pretty tiny, Kath. You might fit in there. That's what it is. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Well, we don't want to put you in there.
No, no that's not funny. Beautiful spec, and I'll share that with everybody that's watching right now so you get an idea what they ordered. Uh, but this two-tone red seat interior, accented with the red calipers out here. Oh, nice job. Ooh. I mean, really, truly I had nice job. I have some good help. Yes, nice job. And you have to... Push that. You have to push that two times. There you ah. go. First time is just a little bit, so it allows you to put your cord through there if you got the battery charger, and then the second time you close it down. Okay. And then of course with the new software and the update. The is over. Yes, yeah. so it tells you two things. I discovered a new screen, because it tells you max speed if the hood is open, uh. Uh, 26 miles an hour. And the other one, it says if you just okay. you ignore that, it says stop the vehicle now. Okay. Your hood is open. <laughs> it's like, beep. okay, yeah, all right, we get it. Yeah. We get it. See if I can get up close on this paint for you folks watching the channel right now. And oh, here's a good shot right here. Look at that paint, I'll stop moving. Sure. So you have an opportunity to appreciate it. Just for a second, that's though. A, you see, this is this is the type of day you want for this. It's a different car depending on the uh, where the, the angle. Is. The oh, angle, most certainly. Yeah. Right. Wow. That is beautiful. It really is. Well, nice job, guys. You know, it's crazier earlier, and I didn't capture it on the vlog, one of the deliveries we did earlier today. Don't know if it's necessarily in this episode that we're airing. Guys waited a long time like everybody else to get his car. So he's here, another guy comes down from Northern Ohio and he's looking at him and Phil's here 10 minutes. And the guy says, hey, I'll give you 15 grand over what you just paid for your car right now. <laughs> he just looked at him like, get away from me. <laughs> I want to get my car. That's, and that's normal. It's normal right now. Yeah, it was crazy. I yeah. saw another vlog this morning about uh, why I'm selling my C8 now. And I didn't watch it. Right. I don't care. Right. But, uh, <laughs> that's right. Dan doesn't like the clickbait, and we don't do that on this channel. Tell me, tell me what I, I saw that. I mean, that is so weather accessible and yes wa car wash access yep. accessible yep what what do you suggest you do that you don't have to detail this whole area every time you wash your car well the problem is is that that's a very good question but the problem is, is you are going to have to detail You're just this do it, huh? you really are i mean because you've got it you can see there's even water here from coming down. Okay. So that's always open. You got to get some of the heat out of here. And then the window on the top is cantilevered up like this, so air comes out the back there okay. too. So here's what we're going to do. Yes. We're going to invent something that covers this area and has a little drain tube that will slide down the side of the motor, right? Mm -hmm. And so that when you wash this, it's going to go onto that pan. Here, I got one even better. And drain away. Got one even better. See, now that's what I was wondering. I got one, I got one even better if I can come up with it. I'm going to give this away right now and I'm going to lose an opportunity to make some dough. <laughs> I've been wanting to do this since, actually since the last time that the car was here in September. Uh -huh. So on these areas right yep. here where these uh -huh. vents are, yep. I wanted to come up with some kind of a silicone cap that will uh -huh. go over top of this. Just keep your and then a silicone piece that's a, a yeah. solid piece that'll just shove in there without hurting the glass. Uh -huh. Allows you to wash the car. And then when you're done, you remove those and you're good and no water gets in there yeah. while you're washing it. Yeah. We're doing a vlog. By the time this one airs you taking delivery, we've already let you know how hot it gets back here. So I saw you roast some marshmallows. Yeah, no marshmallows, no makeup, no ice cream. Uh -huh. uh, yeah, temps in the 140s, 150s back mm. here. Well, you could slow cook some pork back here. Though. Absolutely. <laughs> and actually in that vlog, you saw that I was uh, cooking some uh, tacos and chicken and hamburgers and even baked the cake. <laughs> you know, a long time ago, <laughs> I, I read something about people cooking their dinner. I don't, you know, like if they were cooking it or warming it up like right. on a long Egg. trip, you'd figure out a way to put some foil on that motor. And I've seen guys do that. Some I of the older older cars, yeah, they put yeah. foil over it and they uh, put it in there. Yep, yeah. yep. They're heating up their bacon. So this and is not a new concept. This well, is, it's, it's just an oven instead of a roast. Yeah, <laughs> right. Exactly, advice. yeah. <laughs> you're not grilling it, you're yeah, baking it. Right. right.
ever Corvette. I'm glad to be a part yeah. of this. This is pretty Thank cool, man. You. Yeah. Good. You Just enjoy it. it. You made it happen. <laughs> There's Dan and Kathy. Thank you. Here in Ohio, we got him a little send off, Pat. First ever Corvette. Yes, is a 2020 mid engine. Have fun, guys. to the exhaust. Now you know when you do Z51 you get the performance exhaust from Chevrolet. I'm doing just the regular Stingray. You have to choose if you want an upgraded exhaust. Right now I have no exhaust chosen. Thinking that either I'm going to do an aftermarket with my buddies at LMR down in Texas or Corsa Performance. Now when it comes time for me to release the allocation if I haven't chosen one of those exhaust systems then I will do an upgraded exhaust from Chevrolet. I guess I'm looking for something 